uh, East Southwick today as we're seeing those temperatures rising. Absolutely. The sun is rising and so are the temperatures. It's a nice and mostly sunny day, but with all of that sunshine, temperatures do get to soar. We are already at 80 degrees in Gulfport at the lakefront. Biloxi, Buris at 83. Galliano has been coming in the 80s as well this morning. Everyone else in the 70s, but we will quickly warm up. Later on this afternoon, temperatures will top out towards the middle 90s. Notice that we do stay mostly dry. There's only a 10% chance for rain today. So with all that sunshine and the humidity, even though highs will mainly be in the middle 90s, it will feel more like the upper 90s and low hundreds out there later on this afternoon. Very hot and humid. If you are heading out on the boat today, the main concern is the heat and the sun. The sun, especially because the UV index is extreme today at 11. So make sure to protect your skin, sunscreen, sunglasses and a hat. This heat is warmer than what we're used to this time of year. Our average high temperature is 89 degrees, so we are above average. We will be in the middle 90s over the next several days. It's actually near record heat. Now today's record is 96 degrees. I don't think we're going to make it there, but tomorrow it's possible that we could tie that record. The forecast is 94. The record is 95. Now the only thing that would really bust that forecast is if it rained right on top of the temperature sensor at the airport, and there is a 40% chance for rain tomorrow but I think the rain arrives later in the day tomorrow. So you can see throughout the morning and even the early afternoon hours, we stay dry. It's not until later in the afternoon we see rain likely arriving to the North Shore first and then perhaps try and move down onto the South Shore as well. And again, that would be later in the day into the evening too. Those of you who do see a thunderstorm though, you do have the risk for damaging wind gusts. There's a very low risk of severe weather tomorrow, a marginal risk one out of five. Same story on Friday for the North Shore, the risk again would be damaging wind gusts. Overall rain chances are staying low though, about 30 to 40%. Nothing going on in the Atlantic Basin right now. That is what we like to see. However, in the Pacific, there's a medium chance of development near where Agatha formed. But unlike Agatha, models keep this possible development out in the Pacific, not crossing into the Atlantic. So that's what we like to see too. However, this heat though, above average temperatures will stick around through the next seven days.